that sometimes I shoot some cool stuff with my camera and I want to tell you guys about it. So let me tell you guys a story. So for this one, episode one of the Breakneck Review, we're going to go back to Laguna Seca. So this one, this clip happened uh, in the Super Sport round, last lap of the race. Obviously, I'm looking out for my boy Stefano. Um, that's who I'm recording. When you're shooting Super Sport, you kind of get an idea of where your rider should be. Like the pack that he's he was battling with or what group he was he was around. So I, I get an idea of like, okay, he's gonna he's gonna come out soon. I'm lined up right on the straightaway, aiming at the last corner before the straightaway, which is a left handed turn. So he comes out and he's in a battle with Corey Alexander. And my whole intention is to get the clip of him crossing the finish line. Um, so as soon as I see him, I am tracking him, tracking him, tracking him, and I'm able to get the clip. I thought it was a lot cooler than I had anticipated because it was like a near photo finish between him and Corey Alexander. Um, Corey did end up getting the spot above him, but, um, yeah, it was just, it was just a cool, cool clip to get. Um, and it was kind of intentional. So, uh, that, that was a success, but here's, here's where the clip gets really interesting. Sometimes what happens to me when I'm trying to record someone, uh, specifically like motorcycle rider, when I'm seeing the viewfinder, cause I utilize the viewfinder, I sometimes hyper focus on what I'm trying to record and I'm completely oblivious to everything else that's going on around. And that's what happened with this one. I shoot the clip. I know the, that the finish was what I recorded. So I'm reviewing the footage um, after and something in the back of my mind was like, there was something else that I was looking at in the viewfinder that I was like, wow, this is crazy. So I queue it up to when Corey and Stefano are about to appear in the last corner. And crazy enough, when I hit play, all I see is, I don't, I'm not even focused on Stefano. All I see is a rider wiping out behind them you know low siding on the last turn of the last lap and i was like i can't believe in one clip i got a wipe out a near photo finish to end the race at laguna seca and obviously i got what i needed to get which was stefano so i was like this clip is definitely so far on my Mount Rushmore because it's just one of the craziest clips I've ever shot. I couldn't think of a better clip to start this series with. So I hope you guys enjoy it. I'm going to stop talking now. Here it is. <laughs> 